happening today, an emergency meeting to discuss a controversial bridge in Palmetto Bay. Yeah, the company awarded to build the bridge involved in the deadly 2018 FIU bridge collapse. Our CBS News Miami's Morgan Reiner joins us live now with the ongoing battle. Good morning, Morgan. Good morning. Well, before residents even found out about who is going to build the bridge, which is why there is an emergency meeting here today, the bridge itself was a point of debate. The bridge, which is set to be built on 87th Avenue over the C-100 Canal, is meant to relieve traffic congestion. But some residents and the mayor of Palmetto Bay Village believe it will cause more issues than solve. But a Miami-Dade Fire Rescue study says this bridge alone can reduce traffic congestion in the area from eight hours to five. But the bridge debate is even more complex now as the company awarded to build it is involved in the deadly 2018 FIU bridge collapse that killed six people. The company MCM sent us a statement in part reading the county commission approved the 87th Avenue bridge project after thorough evaluation and over the objection of the village. MCM won the contract fairly after an advertised advertised competition. The FIU bridge class was due to a design error as confirmed by the National Transportation Safety Board, not a construction error by MCM. Since then, MCM has successfully completed numerous projects, including 14 bridges. But people still, including the mayor, believe the company has an inside relationship with the county. My understanding uh, of the county process is uh, this was a contractor that uh, was administratively uh, plugged in. I don't know by whom, but uh, through a pro whatever their process is. And so I would assume then that the county mayor could say, hey, we need to take a break here. That emergency meeting is set to take place this evening at 7, where the public will have a chance to weigh in, express their concerns. Of course, we will have a crew there, and we will bring you the latest. I'm live in Palmetto Bay, Morgan Reiner, CBS News, Miami.